actually, um, it's a funny story, I changed my major like five times because I was really looking for what fit. And I remember sitting in my first class, American National Government, and it was like a just relief feeling came over me. I was like, this is it. Carly's exceptional, and I think anyone who meets Carly would agree with me on that. That's not just my bias as her professor and mentor. She just kind of saw what I didn't see in myself yet, and she's really kind of like invested time in me and made sure that I was able to adapt and get all of the attention that I needed. And one of my favorite things about Carly is that she's a doer. I'm the founding president of Project Regalia, which is a student organization on campus that focuses on women of color. We paired them with women of color faculty members across campus to make sure that they were getting to graduation by any means necessary. I interned with Senator Joe Donnelly in his downtown state office. It was nice because it was on the federal side of things, but it was also during a campaign season as well. We can only teach so much in the classroom, but it's seeing and putting that stuff to good use, to put it in actual practice. The hands-on experience of actually working with it is, I think, invaluable for a student's success. Well, we've worked on a lot of different research projects, all involving women in state politics to some degree. And we found Harriet Bailey Kahn, who was a political pioneer in her own right. I want to get her work published. We're going to make a historical marker for her so the world can recognize her legacy as well. I love you, Indy, and it's super bittersweet knowing that this is my last year here. I wish that I could put it into words, what it meant for the investment that I felt from all of the faculty members and the administration here from UND. I feel blessed in a way, because I don't feel like I could have got this attention anywhere else.